Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about the mean value theorem for integrals. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. f of x equals 4 over 2x plus 6 squared on an interval from negative 6 to negative 5. And we want to find the average value of the function over this interval and the values of c that satisfy the mean value theorem. First, let's go find the average value here, my f of c. So my f of c is equal to my formula they tell us 1 over b minus a, negative 5 minus a negative 6 being the a value here. And we roll from that interval, negative 6 to negative 5, of my function. 4 over a 2x plus 6 squared dx. Well, the left-hand side is pretty simple. 1 over, well, negative 5 minus a negative 6 plus positive 6. We just have a 1 out front here, right? 1 over 1. Then, I found the integral here for you, and the integral of 4 over 2x plus 6 to the second power in the denominator is a negative 2 over a 2x plus 6 to the first power, excuse me, so just 2x plus 6. And we're integrating this from negative 6 to negative 5. Simplifying that out, we first plug in negative 5 in for x. When I do that and simplify, I got a 1 half. Plug in negative 6 in for x here in my function, and I got a 1 third, and we're subtracting them. 1 half minus a 1 third comes out to be a 1 sixth, which is equal to 0 0.16 repeating. So 1 sixth is, right here, the average value. If I can write u of the function. So now we want to find the value of c that satisfies the mean value theorem. So I'm going to take actually what I know here and apply it. f of c is equal to, well, I plug c into my function, right? 4 over 2 times c plus 6 squared. And we found that that f of c is equal to 1 sixth. Not too bad. So from here, we want to solve for c. It's just algebra. Cross multiply, 4 times 6 is a 24, equals a 2c plus c, uh, 6 here, <laughs> squared. My 6s and my c's. Square root both sides, and we have a, I'm going to flip it here, well, I'll do it first. Plus or minus the square root of 24 equals a 2c plus 6. Don't forget the plus or minus there, okay? When I flip it around, I'm going to subtract a 6 to both sides. So I have a 2c equals a negative 6 plus or minus, all right, so I subtract a 6 to both sides. And the square root of 24 simplifies to be a 2 square root of 6, okay? From there, we have, well, I divide both sides by 2, and c equals a negative 3 plus or minus square root of 6. And now I want to see, well, which ones are within my interval here, and there's only one of them, the c value of the negative. So minus or minus 6. So negative 3 minus the square root of 6 is the only one of these two that's within our interval, and that's approximately a negative 5.449. But I like to write it in the square root form. And so right here is the value, values that satisfy the MVT, mean value theorem. And so that's our final answer here. A one sixth is the average value of the function, and the value that satisfies the MVT is negative three minus the square root of six. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.